new tonight, a northern Arizona state legislator under fire for making racially insensitive comments defends himself at a Phoenix Soul Food restaurant. We're talking about Republican David Stringer, who issued what he labeled an apology after Governor Doug Ducey and other top Republicans called upon him to resign. Team 12's political reporter Bram Resnick has more on that apology and how top members of Stringer's party are reacting. David Stringer had a hard time apologizing and providing a yes or no answer about whether he's a white nationalist. Republican State Representative David Stringer shared his fears about racial integration with voters earlier this month. In our school system, 60% of public school children in the state of Arizona today are minorities. That complicates racial integration because there aren't enough white kids to go around. Not enough white kids to go around and other racially insensitive comments by Stringer led Arizona Governor Doug Ducey and top Republicans to demand that he resign. I am going to apologize for making statements that allowed someone else to excerpt them, misrepresent them to the community. That was Stringer's apology for his comments at a news conference Wednesday at Lolo's Chicken and Waffles in South Phoenix, 90 miles from Stringer's Prescott District. The event organized by activist Jarrett Maupin. This is not the forgiveness hour. I asked Stringer his beliefs about racial separation. Are you a white nationalist? Never, I have never, I have, uh, I'm not complete, that, that phrase I suspect is used in many different contexts. It took four tries to get a yes or no answer. That I am emphatically not a white nationalist. I don't, I, there's nothing in my career that would suggest that. An Arizona Republican Party spokeswoman said the party chairman wasn't sold on Stringer's performance. She said, I find this to be highly offensive and counterproductive. In the newsroom, Bram Resnick, 12 News.